B negative. B negative blood is among the rarest in existence, found in only about one out of every hundred people. This scarcity immediately gives it a form of biological exclusivity, since those who carry it possess one of the least common antigen profiles in the human species. Its defining trait is the presence of the B antigen on red blood cells, combined with the complete absence of the RHD factor. This combination drastically limits compatibility during transfusions. B negative individuals can only safely receive blood from B negative or O negative donors, a restriction that makes every available unit of this blood type vital for hospital management. From an evolutionary perspective, the spread of type B across ancient populations appears uneven. It is more prevalent in regions of Asia and the Middle East, and significantly rarer in Europe, Africa, and the Americas. Genetic evidence suggests this distribution resulted from selective pressures unique to early human migrations. Certain environments may have favored carriers of the B antigen due to its role in altering susceptibility to specific bacterial and viral infections. This antigen can influence how the immune system recognizes and neutralizes microbes, offering an advantage in regions where these pathogens were most active. However, those same features may create vulnerabilities to other infections, showing how evolutionary success often involves trade-offs. The absence of the RHD factor further deepens this rarity. The RH negative trait itself is thought to have emerged from a genetic mutation in early European populations tens of thousands of years ago. In B negative individuals, the lack of this factor adds another layer of distinctiveness, producing one of the most selectively distributed genetic signatures in human biology. From a clinical standpoint, the value of this blood type extends far beyond its rarity. B negative donations are often prioritized because they can be life saving for the small population that depends on them. In that sense, those who carry this type hold a quiet but crucial role in global medicine a reminder that evolutionary uniqueness often comes with both isolation and importance. O positive. O positive blood is the most common type on Earth, carried by nearly four out of every 10 people. Its abundance has shaped not just modern medicine, but human survival throughout history. What sets O positive apart is its versatility in transfusion. Because it lacks both A and B antigens, but contains the RHD factor, it can be safely given to any patient who is RH positive whether their blood type is A, B, AB, or O. This makes it indispensable in hospitals, where rapid transfusions often save lives before full compatibility testing can occur. From an evolutionary standpoint, type O has left a profound imprint on human development. Its defining characteristic, the absence of A and B antigens, has been linked to protection against certain infectious diseases, particularly malaria, caused by Plasmodium falciparum. The parasite struggles to make O-type red blood cells clump together, which reduces the severity of malaria infections. This gave ancient O-carriers a survival advantage in tropical regions, where the disease was most widespread. Over thousands of years, that advantage contributed to O-type's global dominance. Anthropological studies suggest that O-type blood may have been the most beneficial for early hunter-gatherer societies. These populations depended on animal protein and faced continuous exposure to wild pathogens. The immune profile of O carriers, simple, reactive, and efficient, proved well suited for those harsh conditions. It may also explain why O types tend to have more robust immune reactions to certain infections, while being more prone to severe responses to others such as cholera and norovirus. Even within modern contexts, O-positive individuals display slightly lower levels of clotting proteins like von Willebrand factor, which can protect them from dangerous clots, but increase bleeding risks. In essence, O-positive blood represents the evolutionary balance between adaptability and vulnerability, a type so widespread precisely because it survived where others did not. AB negative. AB negative blood is the rarest of the eight primary blood types, found in less than one half of 1% of the world's population. Its red blood cells carry both A and B antigens, yet lack the RHD factor. This specific combination makes it almost a genetic anomaly, extremely rare, medically valuable, and evolutionarily intriguing. The rarity alone means that each AB negative donor contributes something biologically exceptional to the global blood supply. Its greatest strength lies not in red cell compatibility, but in plasma versatility. 
AB negative plasma can be safely given to patients of any blood type, making it the universal plasma donor. This makes AB negative plasma indispensable in emergency medicine, trauma care, and transfusion therapy. Hospitals often reserve these donations for critical cases where plasma compatibility determines survival. Because of the scarcity of AB negative donors, each unit collected is carefully tracked and prioritized for situations in which no substitute exists. From an evolutionary viewpoint, the AB type itself is relatively young, appearing only a few thousand years ago through the mixing of A and B populations. The additional absence of the RHD antigen makes AB negative a genetic outlier within an already uncommon category. This suggests that random genetic recombination, rather than selective advantage, may have created this combination. Even so, it persists, proof of how human diversity can preserve even the rarest patterns of inheritance. Carriers of AB negative blood effectively represent the farthest end of antigen variation among humans. Their blood is a symbol of rarity and resilience, offering unmatched utility in medicine, while reminding us how evolution sometimes values diversity over abundance. A positive. A positive blood is the second most common blood type globally, carried by roughly three out of every 10 people. Its defining features are the A antigen on the red blood cells and the presence of the RHD factor. This dual antigen profile grants A positive individuals a wide compatibility range in transfusions, allowing them to safely receive blood from both A and O positive donors. That accessibility makes a A-positive one of the most easily managed types in medical practice, ensuring stable reserves in blood banks worldwide. From a biological perspective, the A antigen plays a central role in how the immune system interacts with bacteria and other microorganisms. People with type A blood have been found to mount stronger antibody responses to certain pathogens, particularly those that thrive in densely populated settings. This may explain why a type blood grew more prevalent as humans transitioned from nomadic hunter-gatherer life to settled farming societies thousands of years ago. Living in close quarters, raising livestock, and storing food increased exposure to bacteria, favoring blood types with stronger immune defenses. However, evolution often trades one strength for another's weakness. The same A antigen that enhances immune recognition also affects how blood clots and how platelets adhere. Research links A-positive individuals with slightly higher risks of clotting disorders, cardiovascular disease, and certain infections compared to O-types. Despite these vulnerabilities, the A-positive profile reflects an immune system fine-tuned for survival in structured, urbanized communities, where bacterial threats rather than wild pathogens were the main challenge. In that sense, A-positive blood embodies adaptation to civilization itself, an immune strategist built for the world humans created. O negative. O negative blood is one of the most critical and medically valuable blood types in existence, despite being carried by fewer than seven out of every 100 people. What makes it extraordinary is the complete absence of A, B, and RHD antigens on its red blood cells. This lack of markers means that O negative blood can be transfused into any individual, regardless of their blood type, without causing dangerous immune reactions. Because of this, it is known as the universal donor for red cell transfusions and is often the first choice in trauma care, surgery, and disaster response when there is no time to test for compatibility. In practical medicine, O-negative blood is a lifeline. Paramedics and emergency departments rely on it when treating patients with unknown blood types, newborns requiring transfusions, and individuals with rare antigen profiles. Every O-negative donor effectively becomes a silent guardian of the blood supply, their contributions critical in situations where seconds determine survival. From an evolutionary perspective, the absence of all major antigens is unusual. It likely results from genetic mutations that persisted not because of selective advantage, but because they did not compromise survival. Still, this antigen-free state confers subtle benefits. It reduces immune overreactions and transfusion risks. However, it also comes with biological costs. O-type individuals are more susceptible to severe cases of cholera and norovirus, as the exposed H antigen on their cells provides an easier entry point for these pathogens. Moreover, RH-negative mothers, particularly those with O-negative blood, 
face complications in pregnancy if carrying Rh-positive babies, requiring modern medical intervention to prevent immune conflict. Despite these vulnerabilities, O-negative remains unmatched in medical importance. It represents the ultimate example of biological neutrality turned into universal usefulness, an evolutionary rarity that saves countless lives without ever being seen. AB positive. AB positive blood is the rarest of the major positive types, carried by fewer than five out of every hundred people. What distinguishes it is the presence of both A and B antigens, along with the RHD factor on the surface of its red blood cells. This complete antigen combination gives AB positive individuals a unique medical advantage. They can safely receive blood from any donor, whether A, B, AB, or O, and whether positive or negative. In transfusion medicine, this makes them the universal receiver, an invaluable position in emergencies where compatibility determines survival. The evolutionary story of AB-positive blood begins relatively late in human history. Genetic research indicates that the AB group appeared only a few thousand years ago, likely through the intermixing of A and B populations that had previously evolved separately. This blending produced the most antigen-diverse blood type in humans symbolizing both genetic diversity and adaptability. The combination of multiple antigens may also reflect how human populations increasingly mingled through trade, migration, and intermarriage, creating genetic mosaics that helped balance different immune traits. However, this abundance of antigens comes with its own trade-offs. Studies have shown that AB carriers, including AB-positive individuals, are more prone to certain vascular and clotting conditions. The immune system's heightened recognition profile can make inflammation and coagulation more easily triggered, increasing the risk of some cardiovascular problems. Yet, in return, AB-positive individuals gain an unmatched transfusion advantage and potentially broader immune recognition of foreign agents. From a biological perspective, they represent the synthesis of the blood system's extremes, rare, adaptive, and symbolically the most complete. AB positive is the product of humanity's merging paths, proof that genetic diversity itself can become a hidden strength. A negative. A negative blood is one of the least common types in the world, carried by fewer than two out of every 100 people. It is defined by the presence of the A antigen and the absence of the RHD factor. This absence makes transfusion compatibility narrower, since A negative individuals can only receive blood from A negative or O negative donors. Despite its rarity, this blood type holds several subtle advantages that have influenced both medicine and human evolution. The A antigen is associated with stronger immune recognition, allowing the body to identify and respond to certain bacterial threats more effectively. This trait may have been advantageous thousands of years ago in early agricultural societies, where humans began living in dense settlements and faced a surge of infectious diseases linked to poor sanitation and close contact. The immune precision of A-type blood likely increased survival rates in those crowded environments, giving it a selective advantage in early farming communities. However, the lack of the RHD factor introduces challenges, particularly in pregnancy. If an A-negative mother carries an RH-positive baby, her immune system can produce antibodies against the child's red blood cells, a condition known as hemolytic disease of the newborn. Modern medicine manages this through preventive injections that neutralize the immune response. But before such treatments existed, this incompatibility affected maternal and infant survival. Evolutionarily, that tension between immune strength and reproductive risk may have limited the spread of Rh negative types overall. A negative blood thus represents a rare equilibrium, highly capable at defending against certain bacterial infections, yet delicate when it comes to reproduction. It is a hidden defender, quietly powerful, but constantly balancing protection with vulnerability. B positive. B positive blood is carried by about one in every 10 people, making it less common than both O and A types, but still prominent across the global population. Its defining features are the presence of the B antigen on red blood cells and the RHD factor. This combination allows B positive individuals to safely receive blood from B positive, B negative, O positive, and O negative donors, offering a moderate yet flexible compatibility range. 
Despite this advantage, maintaining supplies of B-positive blood requires targeted donation programs, since it is less abundant in blood banks than O or A types. From an evolutionary perspective, type B shows one of the most distinctive distribution patterns among blood groups. It is concentrated mainly in parts of Asia and the Middle East, while being much rarer in Western Europe and Africa. Genetic studies suggest that migrations, isolation, and regional diseases shaped its uneven spread over thousands of years. The B antigen itself influences how the immune system interacts with microbes and how the body processes certain nutrients, particularly carbohydrates and fats. This has led some researchers to refer to type B individuals as metabolic adapters, people whose physiology evolved to handle diverse diets and environments with efficiency. Beyond metabolism, the B antigen also appears to modify susceptibility to infections. In some studies, B carriers have shown protection against specific bacteria, though greater sensitivity to certain viruses. This dual effect exemplifies evolution's balance between advantage and cost. The immune and metabolic characteristics of B-positive blood likely helped human populations adapt to varied climates and diets, from the grain-rich plains of Asia to the mixed resource regions of the Middle East. In essence, B-positive represents flexibility, an evolutionary toolkit designed for adaptation, balance, and resilience in a changing world. But understanding the hidden strengths of your blood type is only one piece of the puzzle. What if your daily habits could unlock equally powerful advantages? Discover the science behind the life hacks that actually work in the next video. Every life hack you cannot miss out on, explained in detail.